hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll be explaining the five benefits of dry brushing and show you how it's done so before i get into the benefits of dry brushing i'll just quickly explain what dry brushing is exactly dry brushing is just a fancy word for uh, exfoliating your entire body while it is still dry with a dry stiff um, natural medium bristled brush I personally do it two to three times a week but if you have sensitive skin try once a week and see how that goes unfortunately it is not recommended for people who suffer from skin conditions such as eczema or psoriasis as it can make the condition worse now let's move on to the benefits of dry brushing number one it detoxifies your body by improving your skin's ability to eliminate toxins naturally now you may be thinking that's great but how does it do that well it increases lymphatic drainage i'm sorry the lymphatic who and what now and why on god's green earth do i need to drain it the body has a lot of systems such as the digestive system that helps you digest your food and well my morning cup of coffee um, and like your nervous system which well you know deals with your nerves and the people that manage to get on every single last nerve of yours same way you have the lymphatic system that helps your body fight off infections by filtering fluid that uh, flow through your system through these things called lymph nodes for example when you're sick with a cold or you're exposed to a lot of toxins your lymph nodes might get clogged or swollen dry brushing is thought to boost circulation in your body and exfoliating um, your skin with a dry brush stimulates your pores and opens them up which makes it easy for your body to eliminate toxins while you sweat benefit number two uh, dry brushing prevents ingrown hair that you may get after you shave if you have clogged pores. Benefit number three, it leaves your skin all soft and smooth. And benefit number four, it improves your skin's texture and elasticity. And lastly, benefit number five, it reduces cellulite. Now, if you're anything like me, you may be wondering how does that even work when nothing under the sun has worked to reduce those unsightly little things. Well, as I mentioned earlier, dry brushing increases fluid circulation in your body and well, since blood is a fluid, it increases blood circulation by widening the blood vessels. This not only plumps up the skin, but it also short term reduces the appearance of cellulite and long term it helps gently dissolve the cellulite by breaking up the fat deposits. If you're getting value out of this video, please take a moment to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. And now let's move on to how you should dry brush. So three things before I start. One, make sure the brush is bone dry, not even damp. Has to be literally dry. So just put it out in the sun if you think it's a little bit damp. Number two, uh, make sure the you don't dry brush over broken skin so no cuts or grazes or anything like that and third which is a no-brainer but make sure you do it without clothes on i obviously ain't getting naked on camera but you should in the privacy of your own bathroom so i just used this picture that i found on pinterest and i'll leave a link to it in the description box below if you're interested in checking it out the green circles show you where the lymph nodes are and the blue arrows show the direction of how you should brush now start at the feet and go up the legs I do long upward motion toward my heart spending extra time in my problem areas which are the back of my legs and my inner thigh after I'm done with my legs still continuing in upward motions I do my hands and arms both front and back and then coming to my neck, decolletage and chest area, I do downward burst strokes. And then lastly, I finish off by doing circular motions in my tummy area. 
So that's it for today. If you like this video, please smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I upload my next video. Till then, bye bye.